Hey everyone, Scoop Science here. Well today what I have here is this antique 2020 glass Coca-Cola bottle. It's uh, quite a mouthful of a name, that's how antique it is. Anyway. Oh man. Well, it's a good thing I had this container down here to catch the glass. You know, I wonder if I could weld this back together. Let's give it a shot. All right, so putting that little uh, skit behind us, what I have here is just two bits of glass. Uh, this isn't from the Coke bottle, this is from a, a different one. Um, the Coke bottle just got too shattered for me to really work with. Um, but what I'm gonna just attempt to do, uh, I don't think these pieces actually fit together correctly, but you know, I'll just try to put it together somehow so I can at the end, you know, pick it up and they'll both be kind of connected. Um, so that's what I'm gonna try here. Um, Ultimately, I'd want some kind of like oxyacetylene or, 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 or something along the lines of that um, because this here, what I've got, uh, doesn't quite get hot enough and also the flame's quite big. But my thinking is if I can at least soften, you know, the two ends together, potentially, then maybe I can just push them together and it'll weld. So that's what we're going to try today. So this is a will it weld. Um, I guess this could be kind of like a little series. I um, did welding with a hammer once uh, with aluminium. Um, so this could be almost part two to the welding series. But uh, let's give it a shot. So safety glasses. I got some of these too. Um, just to protect me from the heat and if the glass were to shatter also, I'm going to pull down my sleeves just as extra protection. Let's give it a shot. Oh, it's working slightly. I'm guessing my main issue will be trying to have this not just shatter as it's cooling down. I don't have have something to like a kiln to put it in as it slowly cools down. Oh look at that. Okay. Oh Not lose it. All right, that went horribly wrong towards the end. It's really hard working with hot things. I was just trying to put it down on this but that didn't seem to work. So what I'll do is I'll try to start it here. But that, that's promising results. That is very, very promising results. Okay, I'll work with smaller glass. Now I'm hoping the fact that this is on a big metal block, it's not gonna just pull the heat away from it. So let's give it a shot.
really, really soft. I can kind of push them together. Look at that. It's super strange to be able to just kind of put a dent in glass. Look at that. All right, so now I'm just gonna put this in the sun for a second, just where it's a bit hotter than in the shade. It's way too bright for the camera to see. It's just a completely sunny day. So you can't really see that there, but I'm just gonna let that cool down. Let it cool down for a bit and hope it doesn't break. And then I wanna be able to pick it up with my bare hands and have those two pieces uh, stay stuck together. All right, so it's been a bit of time. I think a little bit, actually I was watching it. I didn't get on camera, unfortunately, but I think it was this part here, it just kind of jumped off like, uh, yeah, maybe that was it. Um, oh, no, it was up here, it was this, this part here somewhere. Because I can see I'll get a close up in just a sec, but I can see there's a mark where the pliers were when I squished it. Yeah, 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 so that part there jumped off. But look at this. Let me get a close up of that. Here's the bit, you can see that there, where the pliers fit really nicely. It's unreal, because right now, you know, if I try to squeeze the glass, it'll probably just break. But I did that to the glass with pliers. That's so, so strange how that just, how that happens. It's a weird thing to experience, really soft glass, but look at this. So hopefully you can see that little squish there. So I've managed to weld these two bits of glass together. Now, back to the Coke bottle incident, if I was trying to say, uh, fix that antique Coke bottle, it's not antique, I bought that probably a couple of weeks ago. Um, yeah, but if I was trying to weld that together, it would be near impossible to get it. No, it would be impossible to get it back to the way it was um, exactly. But that is awesome. And this is now yeah, completely cooled down. It's uh, no longer a bit warm, so I'm pretty sure this isn't just going to randomly shatter on me. That is so cool. But <laughs> I got little bits of glass everywhere. I gotta now sweep all this up. But wow, look at that. That is so cool. Well, there we have it. So I have successfully welded that glass together. It's, uh, it's really cool because this was once broken glass. The bits over here are, you know, are sharp edges and so I could accidentally cut myself if I rubbed my finger on it too hard. But over here where it's welded, it's been rounded out. So it feels really cool. That is so awesome. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to see future videos like this one.